Quick note about my guide for Brock Split, Sableye now has foul play instead of Snarl and Firo now has Technician. Before the video starts, I want to say that my Radical Red AI guide for 2.3a is obviously now outdated. And so with this series I plan on showcasing the still working newslock strategies and the newer and better AI. Feel free to comment down below your favorite go-to strat. Starting with the Cerulean rival fight, this fight becomes such a joke with the minus 2 attack exploit. Basically the AI would switch after getting their offensive stat reduced twice. If you didn't know, in Radical Red 3.0, Supercell has actually implemented the random AI to prevent players from PP stalling. The random AI would only activate after switching at least 4 times. My current theory on why the random AI does not activate against the minus 2 attack exploit, is because when you force the AI to switch, it would reset the counter back to 0. In short, the minus 2 attack exploit prevents the random AI from pulling up. Supercell might just hotfix the AI once again. So just beat the game before the next next patch releases. Arbok came out and is now paralyzed, I know this will go for poison jab so I switch to Berserker for immunity. AI goes for Simiseer which I counter with Azumarill. The Fire Ape has the ability Sage Power which essentially means choice specs. Arbok comes out again, I switch to Berserker for immunity and then I finish the snake off. Whenever the AI goes for Hitmonlee, I just use the exploit. Even if Eevee sets up all abilities twice, my snake still outspeeds it. It doesn't matter if the AI sets up as I have the dry skin Parasect. I know that there's only Clefable left so I just go for Poison Jab and unalive it. Then I switch to Azumarill for the easy OKO. Nugget Rocket can be quite annoying with the Iron Head Flinch Chance plus the Koala Resort. But as long as you pivot Intimidate safely, and you don't switch more than 3 times then you are perfectly safe. The random AI won't activate, and if the AI switches to another Moan, the counter for the random AI would reset back to zero.
If you don't have a steel type for koala then just pray that you don't get crit. For the dig rocket, I lead with Otsumero for the easy OKO, then I switch to Charty Berry Parasect for the resistance. Next I switch to the most underrated Moan, Greedent to deal some damage and then I go back to Parasect to finish the squid. Crobat comes out so I switch to Lantern for resistance and I go for a spark to a shockwave here. AI goes for Raticate so I pivot Gyarados Intimidate. Then I switch to Battle Armor Berserker. Lastly, we end the split with Misty. I lead with Gyarados holding a Pecha Berry and I switch to Dry Skin Parasect. Then I go back to Gyarados to use the exploit. I go for Bulldoze here so that the AI next moan would be minus 1 speed. Starmy sees the kill on Gyarados so I go to Lantern for immunity and then to Mighty Anna to finish it off. Toxicroak surprisingly comes out so I pivot Gyarados Intimidate. As you can see the AI still goes for Swords Dance even though I have Roar, that AI exploit only works 50% of the time now. Ludicolo sees the kill with Thunder Punch so I switch to Lantern for immunity and then to Parasect to finish Ludicolo off. AI goes for Mantine so I switch to Lantern and try to 2 hit KO with Spark. I wasn't born yesterday so I know that AI will switch from Paralyzed Mantine to Ferocity.
Mantine comes out again so I switch to Persim Berry Arbok and unalive it. Lastly, I switch to Parasect for immunity and I finish the rest off. Hope I was able to help you, thanks for watching and have a good day.